Okay, so a lot of these um, Hover One scooters are pushed out by Walmart. Not just Hover One, there's other brands too, but they're the main one. They were pushed out by Walmart like a year or two ago, especially around Black Friday. There's apparently a like a defect with holding the pole itself onto the base of the scooter. It's a, like a bad welding job. And I'm going to show you what I did on, uh, on my son's to fix it because the thing actually, the welding completely snapped and my son didn't want to tell me, but of course I found out and um, it's a pretty easy fix. It only costs a couple bucks. Okay, so what you're going to need is a quarter inch bolt. I used one that was two inches long. Uh, a lock nut and two washers, but you're mainly going to need a cobalt bit to drill through the steel. Um, I would suggest getting two because you are probably going to run through it. So apparently uh, a big problem with these Hover One scooters that were around about a year or two ago is that the, uh, the welding around here wasn't very good. And excuse the um, archaic way I'm recording this, but I'm actually doing with uh, glasses so I could work while recording this and show you what to do to fix it, or at least what, what I'm going to do to fix it. So what you need, okay, drill some with some hefty, at least a little bit of power, okay. Um, this is a 20 volt, you could probably do with more than this, but you know, whatever. Uh, but the main key is um, you need a co at least a cobalt bit okay make sure it's well charged now I did half of this just to make sure it was working before I uh because I didn't wanna, I didn't want to try it and fail and be on video so make sure in a good position see I got half of it done right there and the first part of it the outer coat is the uh, lighter part that's the easier part okay now the uh, the inside of it the, the um, solid steel part that's the tough part I'll, I'll explain it real quick see one pole goes inside of the other it's this inside steel one that you got to worry about okay and watch out because you're gonna get shards of metal everywhere I use a quarter inch bit and here we put it on high. Put this motherfucker on high. Ready? And this is the end result. All right. When you tighten this lock nut, you gotta you have to tighten that motherfucker down good. Good to the point where like the the washers themselves bend to conform to the uh, curvature. Okay, so just just let you know. I mean, it's better than new. Look at that. Also, um, you might see that your wheel is slightly off center. All right, you can actually. Um, I, I just bent it. Apparently the wheel, you can maneuver it so that it's back on point by just uh, putting some muscle into it. There's the other scooters there, by the way. But um, I'm assuming that this scooter here, that's my daughter's, is going to have this eventually also because that was another um, Black Friday buy. And I think the reason why they pushed those out was that they needed to get them out so that, you know, they didn't care what shape they were.